welcome back to my channel. So in today's video I have another World Cup makeup tutorial for you guys and I'm so excited because I'm doing Spain, which is my favorite team. Yeah! I just finished watching their game against Iran and it was it was intense, let me just say. This is actually my fourth look I've done on Spain, believe it or not. I do a lot of Spain looks when I do my World Cup series because obviously that's my favorite team, so I want to do as many looks as I can. And it's cool to see how how the looks have changed. Like I'm using the same colors, but how they've changed over the years. So that's pretty cool to see. But today I decided to do kind of like a halo eye effect for the glam look and we went with a red lip again. And then for the flag makeup, we kept it simple and just transferred the flag right onto our face. And I'm gonna show you guys how to do that. So if you wanna find out how to get the glam look and the flag look, then just keep on watching. But of course, if you are new to my channel, hi, my name is Jack Jack. Make sure you hit that red subscribe button and the little bell so that way you are notified of future videos and you officially become part of the Little Flower family. So without further ado, let's jump in to the tutorial. Go Spain! So first, let's start with the glamorous look. So I'm gonna start off by taking this deeper brick red on a fluffy blending brush and I'm going to blend that into the crease kind of like as the transition color. But then I'm going to take this more bronzy shade and on another fluffy brush I'm going to blend that right above the red so that way it just blends out a lot nicer and it's a little more seamless. Now taking a red eyeshadow on a fluffy brush I'm going to blend this onto the outer part of my eyelid and crease area. And then with that same color on a smaller little shadow brush, I'm going to place that on the inner corner of my eye to create the halo eye effect. So we left the middle area of our eyelid clean because now we're going to go in with a deep yellow color and we're going to place that and pack it on right in the middle. And feel free to go back to your other shadow brushes to blend the red and the yellow together. But if you blend it too much, you're going to create an orange color, so just be mindful of that. So now moving on to the lower lash line, I'm just going to mirror what we did on the top lash line or the upper lid. So I'm using the red on the outer corner and inner corner and then that deeper yellow on the center. Now I'm going to take this cream highlighter and use that to highlight my brow bone and the inner corner. So I do have the yellow eyeshadow on the inner corner which I like but I wanted it to be a little more shimmery so that's why I added the highlighter just right on top. So now moving on to eyeliner, I'm going to take a black coal liner to line my waterline and then taking a black liquid liner to line and wing out my upper lash line. And now I'm just going to finish off the eyes with some mascara and lashes if you do want some and then we can move on to the lips. And for the lips, surprise, I'm using a red lip again. This has definitely been a popular option with my World Cup makeup looks. And here I'm using the Kylie Cosmetics Lip Kit in Mary Jo K. So I'm going to start off with the lip liner to line and fill in my lips and then go over it with the liquid lipstick. And that completes this glam makeup look. What do you guys think? So now let's move on to the Spain flag makeup look. I'm starting off with a yellow face paint and I'm gonna paint this on the middle of my face creating a big long rectangle. And now with a yellow eyeshadow we want to set all of the cream product we just applied so I'm going over all of the yellow face paint with this yellow eyeshadow to just lock it into place because we want this makeup to last during the game. We don't want it to sweat off or move around or anything like that. Especially if you're rooting for Spain. I want your makeup to last. Now I'm going to go in with a red face paint and we're going to paint this on the bottom part. So like our chin and mouth area and also the top part. So like the forehead and above the yellow. So top and bottom we want red. And again, I know I'm starting to sound very repetitive, but whenever you use a cream product on your face, you want to be sure to set it with a powder on top. So I'm going to take a red eyeshadow and set the red face paint that we just applied. If you want your makeup to really last, that's the secret to do it. If you want your makeup to smear off, don't even worry about setting it. Now you can definitely leave the look like this because you have the colors on your face so people are going to know you're rooting for Spain, but if you want the little logo, I'm actually going to be doing what I've been doing for the previous looks. Anytime there's like a tiny little symbol or a logo on the flag that's very detailed, I just cut it out 
I print it, I cut it out, and then I just use a little bit of eyelash glue and stick it right on my face. And I find that that is the easiest way to really replicate the flag's symbols on your face. Easy peasy, you know what I mean? And ta-da, that completes this Spain World Cup makeup tutorial. Yay! So that's going to be it for this video. Thank you guys so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed. Let me know in the comments which country should I do next. I've been getting a lot of requests for Mexico, so I might have to make that one my next one. But if you guys have a different country that you're rooting for, let me know in the comments below, and I'll see you guys next time. Bye!